The ruckus is happening, episode five. Oh boy. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Welcome All to recess. Right. Yeah. It's recess time. Recess is back again with two new people with me. Fuzz. Hi. Fuzz I'm not isn't new. new though. She's not. Banjo. Hi. And Trevor. Hello. And obviously I'm Schwa. So guys, yeah, welcome to recess. Can I, before ruckus starts happening, can I go yeah. over, like, the orders of business? Yeah. All right. So we have Banjo and Trevor here, and they're here for, like, a very specific reason, and that's because Recess has a cast, which we officially have together now? Well, you Yay. know, people can die. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, we're going to have to work well. on backups for yeah. Look, I, I'm still working on if Jeff dies from driving this fucking F Ford F one fifty. Jeff did get like a mega truck in the last yeah. week. Oh, so he did get a new car. He did. Well, I mean, it's a it's a huge. It doesn't look like a Jeff car. Anyway, if you know who Jeff is, orders. imagine like a scrawny white, p p pale boy, <laughs> who's a dungeon uh -huh. master extraordinaire driving mm -hmm. a ninety eight. Ford F-150 on the road. Driving a big rig. <laughs> it's not a rig. It's not driving, a big rig. He's, and he's like cruising and perusing down the street, fucking trying to get the ladies with his, you know, fucking back of the truck. Drive them home <laughs> so they could play D&D &D together. My his God. fucking back of the truck. <laughs> yeah. Like, he's like, he sees a girl, it's like, hey, back of the truck, we're going to fucking roll some D20s. Is that... How do you think that that works, Shua? How does that... Well, you see, Jeff makes a plan, right? Jeff okay. Jeff has a goal. He has a he has a set plan in motion. He, he is the dungeon master of his own life. <laughs> exactly. He's the dungeon master of his own life. And he's like, I know what's going to work. It's, I'm going to sell my sedan. I'm going to buy a Ford F-150. And I'm going to get all the ladies in one place. Because, you know, a sedan ain't big enough to get at least 20 ladies. You need a big truck for that. A truck then, isn't big enough to fit 20 ladies. I, you see... Jeff, Jeff thought of that too. That's why the F one he chose the F one fifty. Oh my! And now oh he's probably right now it's ten twenty five my time, so it's like nine o'clock there. He's probably has like fifteen girls right now in the back, and he's like get, calling his mom to get the dungeon, um, dungeon map ready. Okay, now I just want you to hear what you're saying here. Yeah. Jeff has a bunch of girls in his <laughs> back of his truck. Yeah. And he's yeah. going to get his mom to get the dungeon ready. Yeah. He's gonna get yeah. What kind of dungeon is this? It's like I don't want to know. It's like, I actually really don't want to know. It's like yeah. he made his basement look like a, a like a medieval dungeon, and he and but no, he there's did? like a table. There's like a table, and it has a dungeon like map and like and it has all the role like action figures for them to play okay, as. I'm not sure if you're making this up or not, but it sounds like you are. But I still believe it. <laughs> God damn it, Trevor! That's for you to decide. I never audience. even got to finish the business. Well, I mean, this well, is what business. Is about. Look, Jeff, the business. Jeff is, we Jeff got is a track. really good member, the business. and, you know, he needs Let's some ladies in his life. And I feel like that's business, him getting a nice lady in his life. His ladies are not our business. I feel like now they are. I mean, we're not. obligated to help him get <laughs> I ladies. feel that this conversation has taken a strange turn, and I don't really want to Yeah, welcome to recess, Banjo. <laughs> <laughs> welcome to recess. <laughs> okay, orders of business. So now that we have them, we're going to talk about how our rotation is going to work. Uh, uh, the way it seems is me and Shua are probably going to be on most of them. Um, and then we're going to switch out. We are going to switch out everybody, but Shua's podcast and I'm always around. So that's how it goes. Um, we're going to try to do it in that four people each week, unless out of our six like one person can't show up and then maybe we'll do five question mark we haven't worked that out yet if we really want to ruckus that's like <laughs> i don't know <laughs> we'll, if we're ready i don't we'll know test that out one of these days and then um oh yeah oh yeah very big important part we want to start taking questions oh yeah we want to take questions i yeah. mean there's like at least 200 of you all right so where where do they go to ask us questions Shua? um Right below. That, yeah, right below because I got oh, nothing, I got nowhere else. <laughs> well, Listen, okay. If YouTube you did... comments clearly the most cordial, yeah, and yes. respectful of Look, places. Look, I feel like we have questions. the we have the nicest community. 
I mean, we have absolutely a clean comment section. It oh just shows God. how lovely they do, are. Do we have Completely any comments? Clean. It's entirely we don't. clean. We okay. don't. We have no likes. one's cussed in the comments. You can't make until dirty right out now of zero. When I'm about to go cuss in the comments. <laughs> See, so you can do that right now. Answer your goddamn stupid questions, and we'll answer them. If you if you do want to send in a question to any of us, what you should do is uh. Well, there's a ton of different places you could be listening to this. If you're listening to it on YouTube, like exactly youtube.com, leave us a comment down below and we will get to it as fast as we can. If you want, if you're listening to this embedded on the uh, Rooster Teeth site, send, um, I suppose, username Fuzz and ask or send one to Shua. I don't or know what his username to, is. Send one to Bernie. He'll love your questions. <laughs> don't send it to Bernie. Yeah, don't. Don't send anything regarding if you us to the Bernie staff about, of Roots of Teeth if unless you you're telling Bernie them to watch the thing. If you want to Jeff gets a lady, he'll absolutely know. <laughs> Jeff and Bernie, BFFs, actually. Oh, my God. They want, they want to war together, just so you know. What war, she was? The Amazing they Race the war. war, Fuzz. The Amazing Race War. <laughs> the Amazing Race War. Oh, no. That has so many implications. Yeah. Yeah, it <laughs> so... does. It does. You choose. <laughs> Finally, if you wanna if you wanna it's ask us questions on Twitter, war. my handle you should only really send questions to me and or Shua since we're on so many. My handle is at Miel Fuzz, M I E L Fuzz. And Shua, what's your handle? It's in the comment section below. Shua at, 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 Tell at, them at so they don't have to go. God. Okay. That's too much wow, words. I, can't, exactly. I don't, even know how to I don't want to bother the our audience with this nonsense. Let's bring it but right you want to the bother them with the truth? description? Yeah. yeah. Why not? There well, we do. However, anyway. mine is very simple. Just at Trev PC. Super you, simple. Don't Go ask ahead. Trevor questions. You, you, you can. can ask me Trevor, any questions Trevor about me. Trevor was in Degrassi. <laughs> Fun fact. Oh Trevor was in Degrassi. Fun fact. I played Drake's wheelchair. It's true. Yeah. How, how like how strenuous was that on your back? Uh, he's actually surprisingly light. Oh, um, did he lose the weight for you? He did. He did. Uh, but also he just kind of swallowed a bunch of helium every time he wasn't talking. What a so nut! Is that is, is his up. voice actually like Vader's voice? Like oh, it's the opposite of Vader's opposite. voice. Oh my god! Lion, shout out to Jimmy being a nice guy. Oh my god! So how are you guys? What, what have you been up to this week? Working. Uh, I did something really dumb. Oh, what did okay. you do? Uh, and so I'm uh, working on a movie that I probably shouldn't say too, too much about. Um, but I, I'm working as an editing intern. Ooh. And so I am staying in a hotel, but then when I go to work, I go to work in a condo with, you know, heating, air conditioning, all that good stuff. So I wear regular clothes that you would regularly wear to a regular day inside uh and then they said hey we need to send you out onto set which happens to be about 10 miles into the mountains uh and i said okay and they said do you have anything warmer and i said yes total lie absolutely had nothing warmer on i had like a light sweater and did, then jeans did that become like the revenant where you got lost in the woods it was it was <laughs> almost like that <laughs> uh i did find a bear it happened to already be dead Oh, nice. Um, Did you still fight sad. it? I thought, oh, yeah. <laughs> that was, that was the bear from The Revenant. You yeah, found it after <laughs> that was actually DiCaprio. the same bear. That's a fun fact. Yeah. Did you take a picture with it? No, I didn't. But my friend took a picture with it when he was where, where he was kissing the bear. Oh, it was sweet. I, is that what you awkward. do with bears? Yeah. What? Have you seen Winnie the Pooh, Fuzz? That's what you do with bears. Oh, give him a bucket of honey, know. and you give him a little kiss. Get, yeah, give, right. him a little, give him a little smooch. <laughs> So continue, Trevor. So what? I, so did you? Anyway, so anyway, yeah. I was just standing there, and everyone's really nice, but I hate being a bother. So yeah, that's a lie. I really hate like I don't want to like ask for something. I feel like it's awkward. I feel like oh, I mean, they offered first. I don't want to. I don't want to have to deal with that in case it's like oh, someone else got it already or something. And so I, you know, two of my friends I were like, "Hey, I that. think I have a warmer jacket," and I'm like. Don't worry, I'll be fine. You have like, and ice. I'm just over here like shivering, but yeah, you know, like not showing it. You, there's like an ice color coming from to be your chin. About me. <laughs> uh, so, did you get pneumonia after? 
I didn't, but I'm pretty sure my like I was walking away from set back to my car as fast as possible, and my hand was purple. Oh my Gross. god! Yeah, that's bad. Yeah, it was. It was not great. Uh, Did you go to a doctor? But it was like it was like I could see it slowly getting more purple. So like it started at the fingertips, and then like mm -hmm. by the, it, it wasn't to my wrist yet when I got in the car because I feel like once it gets to the wrist, you got to cut that hand <laughs> off. Yeah, <laughs> you were were you ready? Did you have a machete ready? Just like. No, I, I had a ukulele and I was going to take the strings off and oh, just kind of do one of those. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. You're a brave the, the, man, Trevor. More no, brave. What, the garrot it? Garrot it off. Yeah. God. You're definitely braver wire. than me. Why do you have a ukulele? You know What? Why don't you? Why don't that, you? Yeah. Fair enough, Banjo. Fair enough. <laughs> you right. <laughs> it's because I left it in my car when I was moving back from Whitefish to Missoula. I feel like if you brought that ukulele to set, I feel like they'd be like, you, play the ukulele. I feel like we need that. You're the main See, role. I think that I think they would, except for that it's literally only two characters for about 90% of the movie. Well, that that's the twist. You see, and then, and then the twist is I'm inside a bear costume. Yeah. And I <laughs> pop out of the bear costume, and I, I'm, I'm a uh, whatever Robin Hood plays. You've been but, the good guy the uh, whole time. Luke. And they're actually the villains. That's the twist. <laughs> yes. And you They're you really see... mascot hunting. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. And it's actually like Fox and the Hound, but you're <laughs> but you're the fox. <laughs> and those two guys are like the hunter and the and the hound. <laughs> Who's the hound in this metaphor? Not I don't me. know. Not you. He's the fox. He's I'm the, is it the ukulele? Fox. Yeah. The ukulele is the hound. You see, it's actually a movie about a Pretty sure the ukulele is the gun. The friendship between the ukulele <laughs> The fox doesn't have the gun. Oh, that's fair. So the neither does the too. hound. Neither does yeah. the hound. I feel true. like that would change things if the fox and the hound had guns. I, I feel, feel like, like that... the conflict would be gone if the fox had a gun. Yeah, <laughs> that's I, I true. feel though it would be more entertaining, and I feel like Kevin Probably. Hart would play both roles because I feel like that's his <laughs> kind of movie. Yeah, yeah, but it would be a live action, obviously. I mean, ever since <laughs> the Adam Sandler movie where <laughs> he plays. Him and his sister. I don't Jack trust. Uh, yeah, that's it. I don't trust any actor playing two different roles in the same movie. What about anymore. Uh, um, mm -hmm. Eddie mm -hmm. Murphy in The oh Nutty Professor? God. That or was before Eddie Jack and Jill. If you were going to say a recent movie with Eddie Murphy, I was going to laugh. Eddie you have Murphy to say something more recent a... than Jack and Jill. Yeah. More Eddie recent Murphy's than Jack and Jill. Because uh, that's um, when Adam Sandler ruined it. Uh, uh, legend. Oh, you're right. I haven't seen it. I didn't see it. it it's Tom only... Hardy, and he plays twin brothers. How about apparently... how about the Social Network? Because it's Tom Hardy, and he plays brothers, twin brothers. <laughs> no, shut you out. Oh, about... Social Network. Oh, about this I other know... movie where Tom Hardy plays twin brothers. Yeah. Mad how Max. About that's right. The Amazing Spider-Man, where he plays Peter Parker and Spider-Man. Wait, Ooh, what? Are you fucking with me? That's what? They're the same people. Same actor, dude. Are you fucking same with actor. me? Same actor. Crazy. Actually, you know what? To be I fair, it was Tom Hardy it's not the same actor. <laughs> it's no, two it actors played one yeah, character. Yeah, it's Tom Hardy as Spider Man and the other Tom one. Hardy Spider Man and Andrew. I'm not gonna lie. Garfield. That'd be a cool yeah. fucking. No, Garfield the cat. Andrew Garfield. Or even yet, Tom Andrew Hardy Kat. as Venom would be fucking cool. It's actually Tom Hardy as Andrew Garfield as Peter Parker as Spider Man. Can we talk about how Tom Hardy needs to play the Punisher? Well, apparently Does it's he? going. It's he's it's going to the guy who's playing The Walking Dead, who was in The Walking Dead, who died. Spoiler alert. Yeah. Uh, Spoilers, by the way. <laughs> well, you want a list? There's a shorter one of who didn't well, die. Yeah, there <laughs> is. I'll put a picture of the guy. He's the And then when you see it, when you click it, that's who he is. I don't remember his name. When you click name. it, link out a picture to Hallelujah, but only the scene of Hallelujah from like Shrek. I was going to say, now, are you talking about on. Shrek? Yeah. If and we're going to talk about Shrek, we got to bring up changes. If we're going to talk about changes... We're gonna bring up Shrek. Oh boy, we don't we don't talk with Long. Shrek. Okay. <laughs> listen, listen. We move I just, on. This is a I Shrek need to say this one thing. Shrek it was one of the best human beings on the planet musically, and apparently he was the nicest guy. I watched I watched a live performance of him earlier, and like there there was a, a fan who called in who was like this dad and his five year old son requested Ashes to Ashes. And Shrek's like reaction to the five-year-old wanting to hear Shrek sing a song is the most genuinely amazing thing ever. 
and almost made me cry. Back to the ruckus, bitches. Man, Goodness you... gracious. All right. I th can, I'm just going to switch all that out. I'm going to switch David Bowie with Shrek. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that's just enough ruckus. I feel that that's fair. What's with all the 69-year-olds dying in Brit Britain? In all, I know. In all honesty. Listen, it's kind of getting Curry's, weird. Tim Curry's it's getting next, weird. guys. Tim Curry's next. I'm calling it. And I don't it, want it, him to be next. And it's He's even nice. worse. It would be even worse. Well, hell, worse. all of them are nice. It'd be even worse if it was next week. Then there's like a correlation going on where it's like yeah, once then a something week. fishy. If it's three weeks in a row, something fishy's going on. And then we're gonna have to become the Scooby Doo gang. And then we yeah, have we to solve this. I don't mystery. know if I can accept that responsibility. Come well, on. Well, you're already can a I detective. Please be so you're in. You're locked into this. Oh, you're, right. you're locked in. You know oh, wait, how no, you know how drugs work, Banjo. You're the drug guy. Can I be Velma? No, I want to be Velma. Can I be Velma has can I to be, be girl, Shaggy and Velma. Shua be Scooby Doo? I'm fine with that. Can I be Scraggy? I'm gonna I want to be Velma because I already have the outfit. You? Why do you already have the outfit? A cosplay? Can I be have Daphne? I never told you this before? No. Okay, high school uh, for a Halloween party that my program was putting on, I decided to be Velma, and I had like a bob then, so I won the costume contest. I did a really good Velma, but to do it, I had to take off. Um, my glasses and you i don't remember my prescription number but you guys know like without my glasses i'm legally blind so you're velma yeah so <laughs> at the end of the party i had put them down somewhere and i could not for the life of me remember where i went around saying has anyone seen my glasses i can't see anything without my glasses and everybody was like ha 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 that's <laughs> hilarious and they left oh my God. but they didn't get that like it wasn't a bit <laughs> I imagine you in the dark, like, guys, does anyone see my glasses? <laughs> and then the janitor's just like, ha, 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 you're funny. And then he leaves too and locks oh you god. in. <laughs> oh my god. That's like, yeah, it was sad. That's that's some sitcom shit right there, Fuzz. <laughs> yeah. Like, fuck, your life's interesting, Fuzz. You, you have <laughs> weird stories in your life. If we ever do it again. Too. If you ever do it again, bring a change of clothes, and so if you lose your glasses, you can change your clothes, and it won't be you funny. The, you can change the Daphne. <laughs> <laughs> right after. No one will know. Oh my god. Oh well, then god. I won't be able to see what I'm doing, because I'll still be blind. Well, that then that way they'll know, oh, she's actually missing her glasses. It oh won't be god. like, ha ha ha, she's Velma, she's missing her glasses, we're gonna leave her locked in here. <laughs> I'm gonna get, like, a business card that says, hang on. I'm actually completely blind, guys. I need help. So, I don't know if I talked about this last week. Did I talk about the Muppets last week and how they're going to ruin it? You've been talking about the Muppets nonstop for the last two weeks. I don't think I talked about it during recess, but they ruined the Muppets for me. <laughs> Why? Why did they ruin the Muppets? Because the Muppets TV show was really good. It had the Office vibe to it. Because it was like it was like the office, but with the Muppets. So they're kind of like they're kind of like realistic about the world. They did what normal people would do, and it was just and it was overall really good. And then apparently people didn't like that, and they're like, no, we're just gonna boot the director and we're gonna need a new one. And this guy has a boner for the old Muppets, so he's like, you know what? You know what we need? We need. And this is like quote: we need Jimmy Fallon skits. That's what we need on this shit. Oh, and we, yeah. And then we need a human villain. We need a villain. I'm like, no, you don't. It's just the office. It's, it's like, we need a villain. We need Jimmy Fallon skits. We need fucking Pig, Miss Piggy and Kermit back together. And I, that's when I was like, I can't watch this show. Now, hang on, hang on, hang on. I want Piggy and Kermit back together. I don't. No, I feel... but you want them to do it at the end of the season or the end of the show. That's true. I want them to, because the way that they've been doing it is a very, as she was said, office-esque kind of subplot, you know? With yeah. them coming together in like an emotional sort of understanding with each other after their previous relationship, but if they're gonna just like hamstring them together, shoot whatever, shoehorn them, I don't know, analogy them together, then I don't want that to happen. It's very upsetting. It's very upsetting. Yeah. So who yeah. was directing it? Fuck you. Ruining and the show. And can we say? I just want to say this. I don't like Jimmy Fallon. Yeah, nobody I, does. I don't feel like. I feel like that's a terrible way to go with a show. Like, we need Jimmy Fallon skits. That's what we need. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. I keep on getting Jimmy Fallon and Jimmy Kimmel mixed up. Yeah. They're Which one similar. is the one that is terrible? Jimmy was, Fallon. Yeah, I was going to say Jimmy uh, Fallon. Jimmy Kimmel, Kimmel's better, Jimmy, but Jimmy he's Fallon's similar. the newer one. 
Yeah, yeah. they're similar though. They're similar when it comes to their. They're very stuff. similar. Okay, but... I looked it up. Jimmy Kimmel is the one that I hate. Oh okay. no, I I, oh, I don't mind because him because, because, because that's because he of the and Let's Jim Play thing, John right? Krasinski. Okay, you're right. My, Christmas it, pranks. It's absolutely a lot of it is because of the Let's Play thing, but not all of it. Part of it, most of it, probably. That not. is a lot of it. I've been liking James Corden. James Corden's a really good late. Night. He's really good. I like him. He gives really, I, I don't, people a chance. I can't to stay up that late. Dream but I like, like me. I, I dream now because of him. Yeah. <laughs> he, he, and then uh, I think that's really the only one I'm watching, other than ja uh, Jamie Oliver, who's just really awesome. When is do. that? Do you mean John Oliver? That's oh. what I mean. <laughs> Jamie, Jamie Oliver, Oliver. Oliver. isn't yeah. he like a chef? He's a yeah, chef. He's, a, so chef. he's that's, a chef. I'm predicting that he's gonna have a talk show. Talk well, show. Well, he already soon. has like several cooking shows. Exactly. Yeah. Late night. So, I mean, you show. could like him. I was just wondering why you. No, I mean John Oliver. Show. Let's make but, a late night cooking show, guys. It's not a bad idea. It already exists. It's a call. Really? I don't know. Probably. <laughs> well, if it doesn't, cooking. we have a shot. We have a exactly. Shot. Fucking... Hell, even if it does exist, we could do it better. Yeah, saute yeah. after we'll how, do, how we'll do how, it real late night okay. and on and on this stars a, this, or yeah. on something and we'll call <laughs> this it is what nude I picture. Food. Let's do it on Skinamax. Yeah, it's gonna be on yes. Skinamax. We're half nude. It, <laughs> half. No, what do you mean half? Like we're like it's like we have pants. Well you on, can't fry bacon tops. naked. No, that's no, just a rule. We're entirely nude. Yeah. Except like you can never see anything. Yeah, food we're behind a way. counter. We're behind a counter. Yeah. And then, and then Or like like Is it gonna be like the awesome power skit where it's always yeah. Moving the no, because sometimes and... you'll see your dick, but very far away. <laughs> and then what we'll have they is show dicks on skin and our, our, in our studio, it'll be like you can see the stars because that's how like you can see the stars because that's what you want. You want our dicks to see the stars. And then, <laughs> and then, what kind of things will we cook though together? Uh, probably all aphrodisiac food like oysters and chocolate oysters. and venison. Has anybody ever I had like oysters and like wanted to bang someone? Because I I haven't. No, I've never had oysters and wanted anything. What I was gonna say, what, not what oysters. a weird. <laughs> did you try oysters just to see? I'm gonna bang someone now. No, no I mean I've just oysters had oysters is... before, and I was like, oh, that's an oyster. I could say that I have had oysters and I have wanted to bang someone, but I don't <laughs> think they were related. Ban banjo. <laughs> I was gonna say I, th I was thought you were gonna say back to back. I'm like, damn, banjo debunked your theory, fuzz. Jesus. Fucking oysters, the fucking food no, of love. I don't think they were related. It was an I also don't think I liked oysters. Because they're gross and slimy yeah. and, uh, and fishy exactly. and gross. All, all shellfish is really good. Really I good? Feel like we, yeah, we can cook shellfish too. Naked. For a show. <laughs> and then we, <laughs> I, we, I'm not a huge fan like of a bad lobster. Idea. We can I don't also, know why, but it just seems like it is. We can also have celebrity guests. Too. Yeah, we can. Yeah, like, like Amy Schumer. And yep. David oh, Bowie. Okay. Oh, not David Bowie. No. <laughs> when he's a hologram. When and he's a hologram. And Shrek. We Shrek. can have Duncan Jones on, his son. Could. And then we can also have, like, who else would be? Like, Barney? Barney would be pretty sweet. I'm <laughs> learning a lot about you that I feel like I didn't need to know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why we you should, want to see Barney we naked. Should, I mean, he's already, he's no, but the thing is, he's already naked, so he's perfectly fine going in and. <laughs> Seen her dicks. Oh, maybe we shouldn't get John Goodman if we're doing naked show. Uh, uh let's bring John Goodman in. Fine. Yeah, no, bring John could. Goodman in because he'll make us look much better. Yeah, let's get Tom Hardy. <laughs> we should. No, get Tom because then Hardy. that's a horrible idea. Worse. And then he can play he us. If he can play all of about, us, listen. Can, yeah, he can, he can play all of us. What we we can bring Leo in too, and we can finally give him an Oscar. You don't get an I Oscar. I don't think for we're going to be nominated shows. for an Oscar. No, but I mean, we'll no, give yeah, him can't just, like, we can make one out he's of on our sausages show, and cheese. When, we, when he's on our show, we can give him a fake Oscar and make him feel better. <laughs> and, and then he can eat it. And then he can eat it. And, it's, make and, it's, all, and, all, and it's all out of oyster and cheese. Sausage. <laughs> what are your... Oyster what and your... cheese? <laughs> yeah. That's what what kind of combination said. is that? That's, That's what Trevor one. said. Trevor, what are your cooking skills? Like, completely honest, how good of a chef do you think you are? I mean, not great. I was wondering because mm -hmm. of the sausage and cheese statue that you're suggesting here. Well, well sausage I mean, and cheese, hard, sure. Though. I feel like Trevor's a great architect, so I'm just I'm gonna be the one to cook it for him. Yeah, he's yeah, a real I, architect. I, I, look, I'm really good with glue. <laughs> God, <laughs> we're gonna give Leo a fucking a fucking <laughs> Oscar. He can eat with glue on it. Fucking disaster. <laughs> fucking stick, and it's not just any glue. It's like the stick glue. <laughs> where you just yeah, it's like Elmer's. 
Uh, yeah, elementary Elmer's, school glue. Elmer's safety glue. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then but we'll eat it. And we'll it's cover safe. it and we'll cover it with white icing so he doesn't realize what we used. <laughs> oh, so... that's awful. <laughs> well, I mean, he's still going to know it's sausage and cheese. Why is he going to want I icing like on Leo it? I feel like Leo is such a nice guy, he'll eat it anyway. But he'll boiled like... icing, though. Yeah, boiled icing. God. See? <laughs> because we're a cooking show. We can't just buy it. We got to do it our own. Half naked and all. <laughs> Homemade. And then you ruin it by yeah. using icing. Look, we're not Banjo, it was ruined show. the moment that it was sausage and cheese yeah. and glue. And then, and then halfway through the cooking show, we can have like a little sit down area and we can talk to the guests or the, yeah. and, the and the audience members. Too. And, we and can then, then we'll be nominated for late night Emmys. Yeah. Mm. yeah. See? And, and, and we'll, we'll be, uproot the Daily Show. Yeah. And then we'll become the naked Daily Show, which is our real goal. <laughs> Although, I don't know how the Daily Show is doing in terms of that ever since Jon Stewart left. I don't know. I feel like uh, Trevor Knows really good. It's doing and not better just than, because uh, of his name. It's doing a <laughs> lot better than uh, the one that uh, Free Larry Cohen Wilmore. Did. Yeah, the Larry Wilmore. Yeah, one. the Langley Show was he's, just. I a think disaster. he's in last place right now. I want to. He's nowhere television. near as funny as Colbert was, which makes me sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and even Colbert isn't doing very well on his new Tonight well, Show he's or because Late Show. He's not like he's doing yeah. Comedy Central numbers. And is he's he? doing better than Comedy Central. And plus, he's right not now. doing, like, the Jimmy Fallon skits. He's, like, actually that's bringing true. in politicians yeah. and all. But he's, got, he's, he's got his he own skits that I like. about things. And yeah. now that he's off yeah. of, of Colbert Report, he's allowed to care. Turns out the American yeah. people don't give a shit. It, it reminds me of, like, John yeah. Oliver. If, but because it's not on HBO, people don't really, like, pay attention to it. Well, it's he, also, uh, for those types of shows, the viewing... Uh, whatever you call them, statistics, uh, range Ratings. a little more Republican. <laughs> the Republicans yeah. love Jimmy Fallon. And the Republicans hate Stephen Colbert. They do. They do. L they, they hate him less than Jon Stewart, but they hate him. I mean, they hate everybody. What's Jon Stewart up to nowadays? Making movies. Uh, oh, yeah, I heard about that. Yeah. He's making that one. He, made, he movie. Like, made any headway with that? Or? Oh, well, he made one. It released. Um, uh, Shrek in 5. Theaters. Yeah, he made Shrek 5, yeah. Shrek 5. Yeah. John Stewart. It's going to be no, more... Made, it's a political a, drama. It was a, not a documentary, right? But it was based on a true story. Yeah, or it's based Wait, on are you a talking about story. the one that he made when he was still on The Daily Show? Or, yeah, or... when he was still on... Yeah. But he's, he's, I think he's working on another one. Oh, yeah. I thought you meant that he released one already, and I was like, damn, no. he's been oh, gone no. for like two weeks. No. Yeah, and he's... It hasn't been two weeks. He's That's slain. exaggeration, but still. Actually, that's like set, three months. That's yeah. Trevor was on. It's actually John. <laughs> Can Trevor actually is John is Stewart. <laughs> Can confirm my and John Stewart. John Stewart. Man, you should have told us, Trevor. We could have made that naked cooking show. Yeah, but a long I wasn't time sure ago. how you guys felt about Jewish people. So I was like, mm, I'm not sure. <laughs> should I tell? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not Please. sure. Now you know. Now you know. We just hate Shrek. Yeah, just Shrek. Just Shrek. And that's okay. I feel like that's all the, the most... time we have. The most recent thing Jon Stewart's done is that episode of Gravity Falls. Oh, where he, he was, was the kitty Gravity cat? Falls? Where he was the kitty cat judge. Yeah. He was the kitty cat. Um, I'm cool. All right. I'm, ben, all you know uh, is Banjo's a cool guy. I mean, he rides motorcycles. <laughs> he, uh -huh. goes, he goes on the beach every yeah, once in a while. I'm pretty sure really? you mean mopeds. He and deals with the West drugs. Coast North Beach. <laughs> he deals with he drugs. He does deal with drugs. I... That's he true. No, doobies. Look, I'm not allowed to touch the narcotics yet. 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 I have but to wink, 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 wink. You know you're going to get me some of that stuff. <laughs> you know how many cameras we have up by the narcotics bin? At least ten. I didn't Can't say wait for illegally. Banjo to hook me up with that sweet Advil. Fucking shout out to Banjo, the master of fucking thief. Can you get me, like, any uppers? <laughs> what the fuck is you know, Trevor's sad after. when he has to walk. You're going to have to yeah. deal with actual brand names because we don't do slang in the actual pharmacy. <laughs> so you're telling me, well, you're telling me if I don't go to the pharmacy, to pharmacy and say, yo, I need some uppers. Can you hook me up? <laughs> I got a prescription. Some, some of that sweet upper meth? <laughs> you have upper a prescription, meth. it won't say uppers listen, on it. Listen, Banjo, on, the, on the down low, here's what I need you to do. Go on to your low pharmacy low. tomorrow. Open up like a package. Tomorrow. Open up a package of like some fucking birth control pills, and em empty them into a brown paper bag. Hold the weird. bag up a little bit. Meet me in the alleyway behind your pharmacy. I'll pick it up. The money will be in the usual place. 
<laughs> in the in the brown bag. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get another brown bag. <laughs> no, the same right, but you'll well, have to dig through the dumpsters to get it. Yeah. <laughs> I've not found any birth control pills in my time there. So Are you, you looking hard, hard enough? enough no, I'm not looking for anything. I get oh, a slip well. and says, go get this and put this there. Okay. See, Banjo, Wait, this is why okay, you're not so getting dumpster get money. Yeah, that's true. I'm not getting any money. Banjo, you'd make so much dumpster money. You should get money. paid, man. Although, to be fair, I am also not getting paid. True, you need yeah. to get paid. I feel like Student you brought the ukulele. The I'm telling you, the businesses. ukulele will help you. Fucking go up there, make a show. You'll get your role. And then you can probably get back on Netflix Degrassi. Which is <laughs> today, right? Today's the... Today? Oh my god, I can't believe I didn't bring it up. I'm so sorry for us going long, Shua. Today, Netflix put out a new season of Degrassi. No, is it new people, or are they bringing it's people all, back? It's an all-new cast. Oh, They're oh, all new. Ooh, is it like a binge watch? What or is they it couldn't once a get week? Drake? What's he doing nowadays? Oh, you know he's just. Well, you know. Prosecute. I think he's still like, in a wheelchair. He's... He probably. Have you seen the way he dances? He must have polio. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Trump! Whatever it takes. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Be the best. No, he can. He can't walk. <laughs> oh, sure. <laughs> Thanks for watching. No, Remember, ask us yeah, questions. Ask, I love questions. Them. ask them questions. Remember ask Banjo to... a question, but only to me. Exactly. <laughs> ask us right a there. question Let's about me. Yeah. Directed to Banjo through me. Yeah. I got a question. You know what? Ask me questions about Shua. <laughs> I, I have a question for you, Trevor. Yeah. How big is your...